Hi, and welcome back to SoFlo Dining's Key Seafood Series. I'm Chef Dan. This is Doris with a D. Hi, welcome back. How you doing? I'm doing. I'd be doing better if I was in the Keys. But um, <laughs> in this episode, we're going to talk to you about El Cibonet. Mm. Okay, El mm -hmm. Cibonet is a Keys uh, staple. Yes, it is. Um, I know the one in Key West is very popular. Mm -hmm. And when we went down one time, they were telling us there was another one in Stock Island just before... Uh, Key West. Interesting. And uh, we stopped by there to check it out. Mm -hmm. And it was nice, big. Remember, it was Very a nice. big restaurant. Very nice. Um, with Toes a stage. In the sand. I think they have um, um, live live music and stuff like that. Mm hmm. So, yeah, we went there. Very authentic Cuban. Huge portion sizes. I remember that. Yes. Huge portion sizes. Yes. Um, I'd like to get around to go to the one in Key West proper. Um, but we haven't because I know it's down the opposite end, the west end of, of Duval yeah. or, or back in there. Um, but the food is very authentic, very, um, very good portions and very, again, highly recommended by a lot of people. Mm -hmm. um, and they've been around a long time. Yes, they have. Um, actually, I'm looking at the list here of our Key West Seafood Series. Most of these places have been around a very long time. And um, that's probably why they're so good. Yeah, absolutely. Yep. So um, anyway, enjoy. I'll see you there. Till then. Make sure you check back on the rest of the series. I think this one is the fourth or fifth in the installment. So if you didn't see it, you already missed three or four. <laughs> <laughs> and watch next week because next week, hold on a second, we will be doing Lazy Days. Oh, that's a good one. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, take care. Bye. Till then, bye.